So this next one is similar to your T's, I's, and Y's. Um, it's again for some shoulder stability and upper back. I really like this one. I do this one myself. You can do it with or without weight. I will show you without weight first. Um, I call this one the swimmer. So you're going to lay on your belly here. You're going to bring your arms out to goal post position. So if I turn this way, you can see that they're just at about a 90 degree angle right there. Okay. And you're going to reach up over your head like you're doing a breaststroke, bring them down, and then down by your side. So kind of a continuous movement. And you shouldn't be arching in your low back. If you feel yourself doing a Titanic, one of these things, and you're starting to cramp in your low back, you're not, you're not really doing it very effectively. It's um, kind of stressful on the low back. So you want to make sure your core is engaged, your pelvis is tucked under a little bit, and most of the sensation is in between your shoulder blades and behind your shoulders. Okay, so to make it a little bit harder, you'll put a soup can, one pound, two pound, three pound weight, whatever feels most effective for you after 15 repetitions, this being one, two, 